The Taylor Swift concert was so epic. Hey Kendall, did you go to that? Obviously, how could I miss that? Taylor's my favorite celebrity. Same, but what about other celebrities? That's what we'll be talking about today. CVTV? Starts now. You're watching CVTV. What's up? Oh, I was just watching Kendall Jenner's top modeling techniques. Oh, that's cool. She's only been a model for 13 years and has made more than $59 million. That's awesome. Did you know that Tom Cruise is the most paid actor? That's crazy. Well, when Tom Cruise is filming, he has a dress code, and so do we at LHMS. Sixth grade wears charcoal gray, seventh grade wears red, and eighth grade wears black. And when wearing jeans, remember no rips, holes, tears, or frays. Plus, no clogs. Remember to follow rap. Special, responsible, active learner, and problem solver. And make sure when wearing jackets, to button up, zip up, or like to hoodie. Quote of the day is, do anything but let it produce joy. A quote by Walter Whitman. Let's go into Miles to learn more about how to be a celebrity. There are a lot of celebrities in the world, but they don't have to be rich and famous. They can be average people like us and our peers. There are many different ways to become a celebrity, whether it be having lots of friends or being nice to others around you. Throughout the world, there are over a million celebrities with a lot of riches and fortune, some of those being Justin Bieber, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, and Taylor Swift. But what makes us celebrities? Some ways are being known by a lot of people, or getting a lot of attention, or maybe even your talent. In 2004, at age 14, Taylor Swift signed a music publishing deal with Sony, making her the youngest singer in the company's history. From 1996 to 2004, Dwayne Johnson was now known as The Rock. He was called this because of his wrestling career with WWE. In 2009, at age 15, Justin Bieber made a song called One Time, which is the song that made him famous. Well, I'm going to go learn some more about celebrities. This is Miles, reporting for CVTV. Thanks, Miles. I didn't know celebrities could be average people like us. Anyways, the math problem of the day is 5x plus 3 multiplied by 12x minus 6. The answer is 16x to the power of 2 plus 6x minus 18. The science fact of the day is that there's only 1,864 pandas left in the wild. Kate, we're getting off track. I wonder what the top 10 celebrities are. Let's ask Aslan. Did you know Jennifer Lopez became a famous pop star releasing numerous successful albums? Well, Jennifer Lopez is first on our list of famous people. Second up would be Hillary Clinton, and third would be Johnny Depp. Coming up and fourth behind Johnny Depp would be Donald Trump. And then fifth behind him would be Kim Kardashian. Did you know Kim Kardashian got a Glamour Award in 2011? Coming up in sixth behind Kim would be Tom Cruise. And then after him would be Barack Obama. Next would be Adam Sandler. Did you know that in 2019, Adam Sandler was nominated Best Actor by People's Choice Awards? But then in ninth place would be Betty White. And lastly on our list would be Miley Cyrus. Did you know Miley Cyrus's real name was actually Destiny Hope, but she legally changed it to Miley Cyrus because of a childhood nickname. Anyway, I'm Aslan signing off for CVTV. Thanks Aslan for all those amazing celebrities. Oh, it looks like I'm getting a call. Okay, well, on to the interviews. My name is Alejandro Soto Rivero, and my favorite celebrity is Ice Spice. Hi, my name is Paisley, and my favorite celebrity is Adam Sandler. My name is Karina, and my favorite celebrity is Dave Mustaine. My name is Reagan, and my favorite celebrity is Bob Ross. And my favorite celebrity is Megan Thee Stallion. Hi, my name is Liana, and my favorite celebrity is Ryan Reynolds. My name is Ryan, and my favorite celebrity is Tom Holland. Mm-hmm, got it. My director just told me that we're running out of time on this show, so I guess that's it. I'm Kate. And I'm Kendall. Signing off of... TV TV. You are tuned into CBTV. Cougars, today is Thursday, April 20th, and these are the announcements. Sixth grade wears charcoal gray, seventh grade wears red, and eighth grade wears black. Remember, no rips, holes, tears, or frays in your pants. Plus, no crocs. Remember to follow RAP, respectful, responsible, active learner, and problem solver. Sixth graders go to the sixth grade building, seventh graders go to the blacktop, and eighth grade goes to the auditorium. And if you're hungry, before class, go to breakfast in the cafeteria. Always bring your fully charged laptops to school and order your yearbooks before it's too late. 